brushing away the snow in front of his house, he happened to look up and there was Winnie the Pooh, who was walking round and round in a circle. Hello, said Piglet. What are you doing? Tracking something, said Pooh. Look, he pointed to the ground. Paw marks, Piglet squeaked. Oh, Pooh, do you think it's a, a woozle? It may be, said Pooh, and went on tracking. Piglet, after a minute or two, ran after him. It's a funny thing, said Bear, bending over the tracks in a puzzled sort of way. But there seem to be two animals now. There was a small spinny of large trees, and it seems as if the two woozles had been going round this, so Pooh and Piglet went round after them. Suddenly, Pooh pointed excitedly in front of him. Look, he said, the tracks. A third animal has joined the other two. Then Pooh looked up into the branches of a big oak tree and saw his friend, Christopher Robin. Silly old bear, said Christopher Robin. What were you doing? First you went round the spinny twice by yourself, and then Piglet ran after you, and you went round again together and... Wait a moment, said Pooh. He fitted his paw into one of the tracks, scratched his nose twice, and said, I see now. I have been foolish and deluded, and I am a bear of no brain at all. You're the best bear in all the world, said Christopher Robin. 